Genesis chapter 39, I shall be reading verses 2, 3, and 4. And the Lord was with Joseph, and he was a prosperous man, and he was in the house of his master, the Egyptian. And his master saw that the Lord was with him, and that the Lord made all that he did to prosper in his hand. And Joseph found grace in his sight, and he served him, and he made him overseer over his house, and all that he had, he put in his hand. Joseph was held captive, but even in his captivity, he was prosperous. Joseph was a slave, but even his master favored him. And this, this was just because the Lord was with him. Everywhere you go this year, the Lord shall be with you in Jesus' mighty name. The presence of the Lord shall not leave you. The shaking of the Lord shall not leave you. The glory of the Lord shall not leave you. In the office, the Lord shall be with you. It shall cause everything to, to do to prosper. Your strength is not enough. Your intelligence is not enough. Your power is not enough. You need the presence of God. You need the presence. You need the presence of God. I, because Joseph was a righteous man, the presence of God went with him. As you live a righteous life by sacrifice, the presence of God shall be with you. Your bosses shall favor you. Your supervisor shall favor you. Your colleagues shall favor you. Everywhere you go, the presence of the Lord shall be with you. And because of that presence of the Lord, everything you do shall prosper. I reboot the spirit of barrenness. I reboot the spirit of failure. I reboot the spirit of rejection. Let the glory of the Lord overshadow you. Let the power of the Lord overshadow you. Let the favor of the Lord overshadow you. I reboot the spirit of disfavor in Jesus' mighty name. Look at what happened to Joseph. He was a slave. He was supposed to be oppressed. He was supposed to be victimized. He was supposed to be held cap captive. But yet, even in his captivity as a slave, as a maid, as a servant, the Lord was with him. And, and even in captivity, he was made an overseer. You are the Joseph of this generation in Jesus' mighty name. No matter what you are facing now, refuse to compromise. God shall turn away your captivity in Jesus' mighty name. God will turn around your captivity in Jesus' mighty name. Joseph became an overseer in a foreign country. Overseer of his master's house. I pray for you today that the presence of God shall be with you. The shadow of God shall be with you. The angels of God shall watch over you. In your job, the Lord shall be with you. In your businesses, the Lord shall be with you. In the marketplace, the, the Lord shall be with you. In your ministry, the Lord shall be with you. Say, cause the Lord to be dismissed against you. You shall not put your fingers into sin. As you live a life of sacrifice, of holiness, the power and presence of God shall always be with you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.